Hey you guys. So the word acceptance keeps coming up over and over again lately. I'm talking to different people about things that they're struggling with and kind of looking at things I'm struggling with and this idea of acceptance keeps coming up. And so I've been thinking about like, what does that word really mean? And is accepting things just something I can do? Like it's a, it's a failure that I'm not accepting things. And for me, acceptance is really a process. First off, I had to understand that acceptance is really just acknowledging sort of the unvarnished truth about the reality of the situation as it stands right now. And a lot of times I hear people use the word acceptance and what they really mean is endurance. Like, well, that's just how things are, you know, but, but that's not, that doesn't work for me because a lot of situations on their surface are just unacceptable. I'm not accepting this. But the thing is, First, I have to be able to really see things as they are. And also part of acceptance for me is looking at what the consequences are of not being willing to see things as they are. You know, what sort of pain has it caused me? What sort of struggle has it caused me? Because I don't really want to look at a situation and accept it for how it is at the moment. Because I can, unless I can really see things as they are and I can accept them as they are right in this moment, I'm never going to be able to take effective action on them. You know, I don't want to live a life of endurance. I mean, there's times when that's really the only choice. But oftentimes, I have to see a situation as it is if I'm going to figure out how to take effective action. And, you know, kind of the whole philosophy of life for me is like, what do I need to do so that I can have sort of peace in my body, be comfortable with myself, comfortable in my own skin, and have some agency in my life? take effective actions, be able to change the things around me that aren't acceptable. And, you know, some things I can change myself and some things the only way I can change them is to just not have them in my life anymore. But until I'm willing to sit down and look, even if it's scary, even if it's uncomfortable, and let's face it, the only reason I'm not looking at things and seeing the unvarnished truth is because it's either scary or uncomfortable or both. And until I'm willing to just sit down and see things as they are and not make up a story and not have judgment, but just look at the facts of how a situation is or how I'm showing up in that situation. Until I can see that and accept it and see the consequences that I've been suffering for not seeing it and accepting it, I'm never going to be able to take effective action and move forward. And the whole yeah, I just want to be able to move forward. I want to be able to build a big, cool life. And this acceptance piece is a big part of it. But it's not something I could just do. It's, some, it's a process that I have to work towards. Anyway, I hope your day is going better than you think it is. I'll see you next time.